Hello and welcome to new session of Fitchcam 2016. We are in chapter 3.3. .3. Here I'll be explaining you how to convert an imported model to a stock. So as usual open Fitchcam then complete the wizard and create a stock. Then you go to file import and you can see that you can import so much of files starting from step files to PowerShell. Proe, Inventor, Catia, SolidWorks, etc. You select one of the extension and open the file. And next feature cam will take you to import wizard. So it asks you use the wizard to establish the initial setup location and stock size or as of the important model as, as it is and exit the wizard. I would suggest you go use the help of the wizard to do an initial setup. So click this radio button and click on next. Next feature will feature cam will be prompt you to ask select the Z uh, axis. So we have five options to select a Z axis. When you import the file that is import.st import.step file you will get it in the folder import model when you import it you will get this model and with this wizard when you click on this pick two points to define z direction you need to pick the this one as first point and this as second point and that will form your z axis when you opt for along Z perpendicular to a horizontal surface you can select any of the horizontal surface and Z axis will be formed perpendicular to the that plane. Next you can select a align Z with center of revolved surface you can select any of the revolved surface and Z axis will be formed on the center of it. And when you opt for align Z perpendicular to a plane defined by two lines, you select these two lines and Z axis will be formed perpendicular to the plane, imaginary plane that is formed by linking this line 1 and line 2. And when you opt for this align Z perpendicular to the plane of a circle and you select this circle, Z axis is formed or aligned to perpendicular to the circle. You can do this reverse Z on the your uh, display window you can see that the UCS is switching the Z direction. So the import model that you import will be having these surfaces, these curves and these lines you need to select this point surface according to your pick initial setup Z direction. And once that is done, your Z axis is aligned. Then you click on next. It will be asking you to select or orient the X axis. So you just click this, this icon which rotate X direction 90 degrees along Z axis can see that X will be rotating on 90 degrees perpendicular to Z axis or you pick two points which defines the X direction and this UCS will be aligned to it and when you click next feature cam will take you to stock type since it's a turning tutorial I'm going to keep it as round and click on next and then it asks you select the round stock center so you can either select the center point of this circle or center of the revolved surface or center point of imported data's bounding box this is mainly used for milling and once you selected the center point and when you click preview can see that the stock is 
align to this feature the important model we are importing this model and later we'll be converting to a stock but futurecam thinks that this is the model that we'll be working and it will create a stock on this important model and when you click next we need to define the stock dimension currently it won't be helping you but it's good to understand the importing uh, steps understand the steps to import a model so in stock dimension you have two options that is enter specific stock dimension or compute stock size from the size of the part when you opt this enter specific stock dimension you need to mention the length the length offset OD ID etc and when you click preview you will get this image and if you opt for this compute stock size from the size of the part you will get a stock which is more confined to the important model you can add stock size on front back or OD with how much ever you want and when you click next then you need to define the setup XYZ location it's nothing but defining the setup either on this side or the opposite side so wherever you like to have this XYZ lo location you can just uh, pick the points of the direction either on this side or this side or you can just enter the coordinate values click on preview if you're confused and click on next then finally the finished uh, window will come when you click on finish then feature cam will be uh, uh, a new wizard will be opened which which will help you to convert all this imported models for it will go for feature recognition in this case we don't need that so you click a double click on the stock model and go to stock properties and next you click the radio button user defined and click this icon st stock solid and show tick this show all and you will find that a solid is there you select this solid and click OK and apply and when you click OK you have just converted the imported model to a stock